Islamic movement in Nigeria, IMN, has vowed to continue the push for the release of their leader, El Zakzaki Ibrahim, who has been in detention for a while now. An IMN cleric, Abdullahi Zango, disclosed this during a press conference in Abuja. He says that the recent clampdown on the sect and the bloodbath during its last annual trek will not in any way deter the group until justice is done. Zango says the death toll now stood at 47, while about 1,000 Shiite members were yet to be accounted for following the clash with security forces. He adds that the sect has, sent over, has spent over 8 million naira treating the injured and needs another 25 million naira to manage other casualties. If you read our history, nobody can threat us with death. In fact, by killing us, let me tell you that they are digging their grave. You can mark my word. They are digging their grave. And, 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 and secondly, they are showing the whole world their weakness. Why should you always be very showing your heroism when facing defenseless people, women, children, unarmed people? So this threat is just an empty threat that it, it, it just exposes their weakness to us. This is what will, they, their type will be called and then prosecuted, inshallah, after their regime. Their only protection now is that they are now, they are now, they are now in government. But after that, we we'll take them to international criminal court and they will be prosecuted. We are, we are, we are, we are, we are Allah's army. And we do fear nobody. We don't fear death. So they can't do us anything.